The right air to fuel ratio enables fuel to burn at maximum efficiency. Keeping the mass airflow sensor clean as it measures airflow improves this air to fuel ratio. This helps your engine measure the airflow more accurately, delivering improved performance. When the MAV sensor is not clean, it can cause improper air fuel ratios, causing misfires, as I experienced firsthand on the Boxster. Cleaning the MAV sensor can clear up misfires and other headaches, and is a good first step if you have misfires or just want to improve efficiency. Enough chit chat. In this video, we're going to cover how to remove or replace the mass airflow sensor and show how to clean it on the Porsche Cayenne base model 957. Step 1. Remove engine covers. On all of the covers, there's a variety of either plastic flathead screws or Torx screws. On the right hand side, there's a screw here that you can't see me undo thanks to iPhone's autofocus, but we can see the empty spot. There should be one over here that you move in the same way. This is T25. Handy toy, came in handy for the Boxster bumper too. Link in the description. I wanted to show here, like in all my other shots, how it's easy, smooth, and step by step. But for some steps, you do have to wiggle it to get it out from under the trim. Don't be, don't despair if it's not straightforward. Should be fasteners here and here. My air intake hose is broken, so you don't see clips on the right hand side here. But first, press in on the clips that should be on this hose, holding this mass airflow sensor unit of hose, and pop it out. It might take some force. Disconnect the electronic connector by pushing on the tab and pulling the connector out. And lastly, this also might take some force. Pull out the sensor housing. It has the sensor inside. Step three, remove MAF sensor. The MAF sensor is held in by T5 security Torx screws. It's a very specific bit that can be removed by a two prong bit. I'll also link a link in the description under chapters to the specific Torx bit you'll need. So they're five pointed security and you have to buy a very specific one. See my Boxster video. And here are those wonderful five pointed tips. Unfortunately, there's no way to remove this. Just the MAF with these five pointers because the bottom one is blocked by the rest of the engine. Remember how it goes back in. In the next step, we're going to clean the sensor because it can be dirty even if it doesn't look it. Step four, clean MAF sensor. To clean the mass airflow sensor, you'll want to hold it a few inches away and give it short bursts of this CRC mass airflow sensor cleaner. This cleaner is specifically designed for the MAF sensor. The cleaner dries quickly, so we give it a few short bursts, let it dry, and try and get all the nooks and crannies, especially the larger opening. After this procedure, give it a few minutes to dry before reinstallation. Reinstalling the mass airflow sensor. The MAF goes back into, the, into its hole. And we want the air going in from the right on the sensors. So it is oriented with the oily part up this sensor in like so to capture the air. And we reinstall the two Torx T5S special ones. Reinstallation. Plug the map in while you're at it and you have easy access. Now there is this connection. This goes on first. It's a tough hose. Good. And we just twist it into position this into position and whip out our trusty seven millimeter. Give it the same attention. Matching up the trim pieces like so and reinstalling the cover like so. Have to match up. Go around where they do hold. Reinstalling them. Two go here if you had had the clips that hold them. We have the one, two, three, four torques. 